Hello and welcome to another Final Fantasy XIV video with me, Mioni. This time we're looking at a new Mog Station item. This cash shop outfit that dropped alongside patch 4.25 is a male exclusive item, the Distressed Mandeville Attire. This is redeemable for one character of your choice on your account, and like I say, it's male only. This item costs £7.44 pence in the United Kingdom, which is pretty expensive. The set contains a monocle, coat, gloves, bottoms and gaiters, and doesn't give any stats in game unlike some of the other items on the cash shop. This is what the set looks like in game. I didn't have any other characters show this outfit on, but Barry the Lalafell, so here you go. This then is quite controversial, mainly that people have asked why this would not simply be an actual reward item from the Hildebrand quests in Stormblood, which have also been updated in patch 4.25 at the time of this shop item going up. It's a good question, but one that seems to not have any other answer than the obvious backlash people originally gave the old Hildebrand story. They gave it stick for having duties and rewards players who did not do the questline were locked out from. This is actually a genuine complaint, I shit you not. My question then is why would you want any of the Hildebrand stuff if you don't want to do the Hildebrand storyline? It makes little sense to me. And if this is generally the reason they simply put it on the cash shop instead, then that's pretty sad in my opinion, and honestly if we're moving towards that then they might as well just scrap Hildebrand. I remember how epic the original dungeons were, and how they actually added to the content in the game. Now without those things, it feels kinda lame. Either way, this set as you can see is what you would expect. It is exactly how Hildebrand himself looks when he falls from the skies in many of his epic cutscenes or over the top fight cutscenes that run throughout the questline. It's a cool piece, but I'm concerned whether this set is both worth £7.44 and why it's male only. The point that people have made since the game's launch is why can't more sets be gender neutral, so we can all equip the items from the store? Sure, some outfits might look silly on males and vice versa, but isn't that up to the player to decide? If they are really worried about immersion, I'm pretty sure that went out of the window a long time ago anyway, especially with dyes. Regardless, this has been a preview of a distressed Mandeville attire. Let me know what you think of this item below, and I'll see you all next time.